quite simply, it doesn't get any more pressure packed than this. The decisive game at the Euros with everything on the line. Which country will be crowned champions of Europe? It's going to be fascinating finding out. Next on EA TV. And this is the game we've all been waiting for. The final itself here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. I'm Derek Ray, sitting high above the halfway line. And next to me, ready to provide expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. This should be fiercely contested. It's Spain against England. Well, there's going to be some nerves out there for sure, but what an occasion this should be. It's going to be tense, it's going to be tight, but it's also going to be dramatic. It should be a terrific game. Playing it short. Fabian. Can he finish? And able to close down the shot. Keen to take it short here. And it's gone over the line. Alvaro Morata, a wonderfully driven forward. And Stuart, you would have to suspect he's going to have something to say for himself here. Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. And England with acres of space out wide. And Kane prepared to fire. And the keeper has possession of it. Morata. going to end up being productive for them and possession lost intercepted Rodri must take the lead here oh but he's missed it how on earth is this still level well I just don't know Derek just a real lack of composure in the end they should be ahead now Well, psychologically for England, it was such a difficult thing to go through at the last Euros when they lost to Italy on penalties, so near and yet so far. How will they deal with the pressure of the final on this occasion? Well, I think they're a very good team. I think they're playing with a lot of confidence. They've got good team spirit. The manager seems to have got things right, which he didn't do in previous tournaments in the big games. I think this is going to be a good performance, and I think they will win the game. Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. Here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And then the perfect finish from Foden. Great technique. There's no stopping that. One nil then. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Pedri. And he might be through here. Surely. Oh, the equaliser. Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, here's the replay, and it has been coming. They've played some great football in this game, and they fully deserve this goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Trippier. Phil Foden. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Kane. Kane. Shins in the centre. 
Not quite the cross he was hoping for. So now a corner. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Breaking at pace. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. And making considerable progress with the ball. Not out of the woods yet! And the keeper has it after that tension-laden sequence. Well, what a great first save that was. How did he stop that? Miko Williams. Who can he pick out? And behind it's gone for a corner. Taken short. And Morata's in the vicinity. Oh, a goal to give them the lead. And look at the celebrations. Let's take another look because it's a well-worked short corner that just changes the angle of the cross and it's a comfortable finish in the end which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Opportunity in the wide area. Could play it in. And he read it well defensively. And England being afforded too much space. Chances on. Well, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, they have it again. And he's made headway. And the keeper to the rescue. Well, he takes some beating, that's for sure. It really is a top-class save. Well, opting for the short corner. Morata is up there. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Now sending it in. Well, they weren't able to capitalize. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Foden. He's in here. And it's still on. Just can't get it past him. An England corner as they look to get back into this game. And there's the delivery. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Trippier. And a useful cross. And goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Morata. Really good challenge. Morata. And he's broken free main priority to hit the target but couldn't do so well it's certainly like to have that back again that was a big chance missed and Spain regaining possession happy to take on the shot a smart stop here 
Counter-attacking, very much an option. Oh, he's through here. Still a chance. Well, that is high-level goalkeeping. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. That's goalkeeping of the highest quality, I would say. And England pushing forward with options available. Well, that cross was more than acceptable, but they couldn't fire at home. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Morata! Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. Wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. impending danger but good defending and so it is the first half story has been written So into the second half, can England bounce back after that first 45? Now the attack fizzled out. Fabian. On the ball, Morata. Oh, the threat is there. Well, going for power from there, but not worrying the goalkeeper in the slightest. Saka. Jude Bellingham. Now, who can he play it to? Bellingham! Laporte with the block. Alexander Arnold. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Well, he's not happy, is he? He just needs to calm himself down here. Challenging for the goalkeeper. Out of play for a Spain throw in. Laporte. in the centre the cross played over and work to do defensively and continues his run he's in here and a goal to increase the lead in this final will they be stopped now Well, here it is again. What a good build-up this is. 
quick incisive passing, clever movement and all done at pace, which led to a simple finish. That's a real joy to watch. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Ollie Watkins. Pedri. Promising attack this. But really sticking to the task defensively. Plenty of support here. And he's broken free. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, another wonderful save to add to his portfolio. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. He could pick out a teammate. And Bellingham. Oh, this could really lift spirits. And fine goalkeeping have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game can someone get on the end of this a strong goalkeeping after the corner had been delivered and a really good run but nothing comes of it Teammates available. Alexander Arnold. Well, oh, beating his opponent with ease. It's got to be. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And quick thinking to react to the situation and concede the throw. Here it is now, a substitution. Must score! Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Over it comes. Oh, that's not a good clearance. Rice. On to Walker. Foden could reduce the deficit. And that'll be a Spain throw in. An example of how to press. Morata. How far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Kukureya. Mikel Marino. A quarter of an hour remaining here. England couldn't hang on to the ball. Carvajal. Spain unable to hold on to the ball. And Bellingham. Foden. Chance to make a game of it here. Vital intervention. Ten minutes to go. Can he take them on and beat them? Real chance! Oh, a challenge of the highest order! Now, space for England out wide. That is tackling of the highest order. Rodri. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Room to roam on the wing for England. A oh, disappointing end to the move.
Laporte. Kukureya. Miko Williams. Oh, possession lost by Spain. Pedri. Oh, great attacking play. Trying his luck. And a fine stop. And time for the change now. And they're going for the short one. Loves to cut in from the wide areas. That was going in. Oh, he's lost possession. And it's at the moment for Morata. Nicely saved. And over it comes. Struggling to get it away. And there goes the final whistle. Spain have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment. But ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserving champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate. The trophy about to be presented. The European champions, Spain! What a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. doesn't get any better than this does it a chance now to celebrate with their own fans and the fans have also played their part just listen to the noise here great end to this tournament